Hi, this is Gali Goldfarb and welcome to my Gorilla Life Coaching videos. Five times a week I talk about a quote that can help you move your life to a better, healthier and happier place for you and I hope you gain a lot of value from these videos. So how are you doing today? I hope you've woken up early because today our quote of the day is, the first step to win yourself is to wake up early by Sukant Ratnakal. Waking up early is a commitment that has the potential to completely transform your life and rid you of many of your problems. When you wake up early, you have solitude time to reflect on your life and on your choices, allowing you to make better choices for your life in the future whenever you need. Waking up early toughens you up and shows you that you can do things differently from most other people. You can be stronger, more persistent, and more de determined than many others. Yes, of course, the cost is always there, but the heaviest cost is in the beginning when forming the habit. It is like uh, the business term economies of scale, which is uh, about the advantages reaped by companies when production becomes more efficient with time. The cost to you will be high in the beginning. There will be discomfort, maybe even fear of waking up when it is still dark outside and the discomfort of going to sleep early while all your friends stay out till late. But as you become accustomed to waking up early and your body adjusts to it, you will see great rewards available to you from this one habit. Once your body and mind adjust, there will be no more cost to you because this will have become your new normal. But the benefits will be massive. In the early morning hours, there are no telephone calls, no disturbances, and no other businesses open, so you are not you are not expected to be available to whomever you may, uh, may need you. Your household is also a still asleep. You have quiet, you have peace, and your cares seem to flee away when you wake up at this time. You feel as if you are alone in this world, and you can do anything. I personally love going on a run before dawn because when I run in the dark and there are no cars and no people around, I don't lose my focus. The air is cleaner and there are no distractions so I can actually meditate while I'm running. It's easy for me to get into the theta brain waves when there are no disturbances and I run on my usual route every single day at, every, at the same time. Now, getting into this meditative uh, brain state is not only very, very healing practice for the body and mind, it also allows deep and profound learning, a sense of inner peace as well that follows you for the next six hours of the day. So I truly recommend implementing this early wake-up schedule for its life-transforming effects. When my daughters went to school before the coronavirus lo lockdown, I would wake up at around 5.30, 6 uh, a.m. naturally since I've been doing this for years. But now that we are in lockdown due to the coronavirus and my daughters cannot attend physical school, but instead mu must join Zoom classes in the morning that begin at 8.30 in the morning, I began waking up regularly at a quarter to five in the morning. I need these quiet early hours in the morning to exercise, read, write, and prepare these videos for you. Otherwise, I get wound up in the day's responsibilities and my duties of my other businesses and my family. I am actually much happier since I made this change about six months ago. When I changed my wake-up time, at first it was very hard, and it, I did at times get off track, but I got back on track the following day. Now, even if you do get off track and you stop the early wake-up for one day, don't be worried about it. Just get back on track the next day. In this way, even if you get off track every other day, but get back on track the next day, then you will still be in the good habit at least 50% of the time. Another main advantage of waking up early is that the actions that you take become evidence for your subconscious mind about who you are. When you are waking up so early every day and exercising and meditating and in a state of peace of mind, then you are telling your subconscious mind that you are strong, that you are powerful, persistent, determined, and under control, and that you can achieve anything. When the subconscious mind gets this feedback, every day, then the subconscious mind will ensure that you become that person that you wish to be. When you start a new action and you adhere to it, then you are actually changing who you are. You are changing your identity as a result of your new habit. You are becoming a better person, the person who you truly desire to be. 
you become that stronger, fitter, healthier, both emotionally and physically, and more powerful person just because of this one new habit. Wow, can you imagine the effects on your life when your subconscious mind accepts these attributes to be real for you? Well, can you imagine how powerful you become because of this? You can achieve anything you set your mind toward to achieving. It usually takes about three months to fully incorporate a new habit, so I recommend you devote three months to trying this powerful habit out for at least six times a week. And then if you find that you really do not connect with it and do not feel any benefits, then stop. But do not choose before you have tried it out for three months and experienced the massive benefits that you will get. Now, I understand that there are people who are night owls and do not like to awaken early in the day. But I still suggest you give it a try because the most regenerative sleep happens if you fall asleep before 11 p.m. This is why you should be in bed ready for sleep at 10 p.m. The reason is that when you are asleep, there is no surge of stress hormones that usually happens if you stay awake after 10, 30, 11 p.m. This will further prevent you, this surge of uh, the stress hormones will further prevent you from falling asleep for a few more hours afterwards. With time, this ruins your body's rhythm and affects your learning, concentration, and calmness. People with insomnia have been cured by waking up early and slowly going to sleep early. When you do something new, you become someone new. If the richest man in the world currently says, go to bed early and wake up early, these morning hours are good, then I think it is safe to say that it is a good habit to adopt. This quote is by Jeff Bezos. The best way to get into the habit of waking up early is by being consistent with your bedtime and wake up hours. I found that even if I delay my bedtime by 20 minutes after 10 p.m., then as it changes my bedtime, it also disturbs my wake up time, making it much harder for me to get out of bed in the morning. So I recommend you stick to a, uh, a schedule that you follow every day. I also recommend turning off any blue light on your smartphone and computer screens by moving them to night shift mode so that they don't mess up with your sleep rhythm. I personally have my night shift on my phone and computer all the time. Now, since you can't turn off blue light on your television set, try not to watch TV for at least 30 minutes before you go to sleep and spend the last half hour of your day reflecting, reading, meditating, or having quality time with your partner. An unknown source said that successful people wake up early, talk less, stay laser focused, don't waste time, live healthy, and ignore nonsense. The habit of waking up early helps put your whole body back into, the, into a peaceful rhythm, back into sync with the day and night cycles that our bodies lived by for millions of years before the modern era began. Melatonin, the hormone that regulates our sleep, our sleep-wake cycle is released about an hour after sunset and reaches its peak at midnight. So if you're not sleeping by midnight, you miss out on the best restorative sleep when the body is healing itself and the brain is reorganizing all the data that it received throughout the day. Remember that it is your choice when to wake up and what life you want to live. Set up your day so that it will be the best day possible for you and stick with the schedule and start your day early to reap the most benefits of life. So as I always do with these videos, I will provide you with a question that you want to ask yourself so that the answer will help move your life to a better place for you. And the question of the day is, am I willing to try to incorporate the habit of waking up before dawn every day for the next three months? As usual, I recommend writing this question and your answer or your commitment in a special notebook that I have especially prepared for these coaching sessions so that you can make sure you're improving your life to a better place for you. To finish off, the affirmation of the day is, and it's very special for me, this is what I personally say to myself every morning when I get dressed to go out to run. I say, I am an early waker. I am a powerful person. I am a strong, committed, and energetic person. I am persistent and determined, and because of these qualities, I will reach all of my goals and my dreams. Now tell this to yourself every single morning when you wake up and, and try this new early morning routine. So thank you very much for, for joining me. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. 
please also subscribe to my channel and ring the notifications button to get notified every time I upload a new video. And please visit my website, thegorilladiet.com, for anything to help you move your health to a better place for you. Thank you very much for joining.